Okay guys, how's it going? So this is going to be the second um, look through at the Harry Potter, uh, the Harry Potter books. I did a Philosopher's Stone version, oh god it must have been months ago now. I'm finally getting around to doing another one, so if you're not subscribed to me and you saw the first one and now you're seeing this one, how's it going? Cheers for, uh, cheers for coming back to watch it. Um, everybody else, how's it going? I saw you on uh, on Sunday, didn't I? So anyway, the background here is on the left is the illustrated edition of the new Chamber of Secrets. Um, this came out almost a year ago, actually. Um, the uh, if I'd taken the iPad, I could have showed you the new ones coming out. The Prisoner of Azkaban illustrated is coming out the end of this week, and um, not the end of this week, the end of this month or next month or something. And it looks amazing. Um, yeah, so anyway, it's going to be sweet. Um, this book on the right is called Love is Love. And it's a, um, it's an anthology book to raise money for the Orlando Pulse shooting. Um, so there's a heap of comic book uh, stuff in here. And obviously they're flying the flag, LGBT flag. But what's interesting about this book is it's the first time uh, J.K. Rowling has licensed any uh, outside Harry Potter artwork. So this is Jay Lee got to do this. And yeah, it's essentially the first appearance of Harry Potter in comics. And there's the quote. So yeah, there you go. If you're interested in that, check out Love is Love. Um, yeah, okay, so let's have a look at the hardback. Um, this is her, obviously. Uh, I got the bookmark. I can't remember if I showed the bookmark out the last one, but there you go. So I think that's the first time the books were reprinted once the series was finished. The first new cover, if you see what I mean. So that's cool. I'd like. I should have really bought a set of them at the time. I just didn't think. I think they're really tough to find. I never see those copies. Um, so yeah, what is this one? This one is... Come on. Jesus. This is seventh printing. Is that going to focus? You can make it out, I think. But There you go. There's all the text. So interestingly, jo Joanne's changed her name to JK. I think she maybe did that in the later on printings of the first book. I've actually got one here. I'll check in a second. But um, yeah, what's so good about this cover is obviously it's Harry and Ron and in the Anglia with the uh, Hogwarts Express going past. But Hedwig's in the back there. And Hedwig's a snowy owl, but that is a painting of a barn owl. So the guy is... Whatever the guy's name is, I can never remember his name. Thomas Taylor is winning because he's already wrecked this one, sticking the train in there, and obviously Harry's already wearing his Hogwarts, um, his Gryffindor scarf, but he wouldn't have been sorted yet if he's only just getting there. Although you, I guess you could say this is after he's finished. This is at the end of the school year, but yeah, why would it be? Anyway, so that's that one. Uh, I had a brief look for errors looking for errors in the text to denote various um, various printings, but all I could find was continuity errors. There was one near the end. Um, what was that page? Right here, look. So, on page 245, I believe this was changed in later printings. Uh, there we go. So uh, it says here, Dumbledore, uh, because Lord Voldemort, who is the last remaining ancestor of Salazar's Slytherin, it should say descendant right there. So later on that gets changed to um, descendant. So I guess that denotes an earlier one. This paperback is, we should have checked and remembered that page, uh, 34th printing. So I guess it's not that early. What we can do is briefly check in this this was like a school's edition, I think it was called. 
uh, only the first four books have been printed um, like this. And this this cover is awesome. Um, but let's just see. I think that was 234, was it? Oh, no, it can't be because that's Dobby's reward there. Uh, oh, no, that still says Ancestor. Even though it's not in focus. The camera's hating this video today. So anyway, there you go. But there's the um, school edition. School's edition, I don't know. It is kind of cool. It's kind of cool. And this printing is number 10 of this. Fancy. I don't know how many printings of this there were in general. Uh, 99, so this was a year. And oh, look at that. Text, Joanne Rowling. Cool. Even though it says right above it, JK Rowling. Does it? Or am I just making that up? No, it doesn't. It's just gone back to Joanne Rowling. Fair play. I think there's a photo of her in this one. Oh, no, there isn't. Oh, here we go, guys. Ray's mobile. So if you want to get hold of Ray, that's how to get hold of him. Although that doesn't look like a mobile phone number to me. I can't believe I never noticed that before. Anyway, that's every oh no, we'll show you a few I was gonna show you the last page, but we'll go for a few of the pictures out of this to finish up. Um I apologize for this. I'll find somewhere better to do it next time. That's awesome, straight away. I really recommend getting these books if you haven't. Dudders. That's quite dark that one. But you can see Harry in the background washing the windy. Look at that windy scrubbed. Uh, that's cool. I should have really done this in a white background. You'd be able to see better. It's Hagrid. These are really dark, actually, these ones. Hogsmeade. We'll see if we can get the basilisk and then we'll let you go. I'll maybe leave the next video until the new illustrated book comes out for, um, yeah, look at that. Holy shit. I'll leave it until, yeah, the illustrated Azkaban comes out and then we'll do the next video then. So guys, there you go. Um, must try harder next time. But uh, yeah, I hope you liked it, guys. Chamber of Secrets. This is one really is the book that sets up the rest, if you see what I mean. I mean, I, I don't think she would have realised how well the success of the first book would have gone. So she's added in stuff here that she builds on throughout the rest of the series. So anyway, there you go. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. And yeah, go check out that Love is Love if you see it in any uh, back issue bins. Take it easy, guys.